Let's go. Good morning everybody, hope that you all are having a blessed day today and in this video I'm going to show you how to trim some bushes. But I did previously make a video where I showed everyone how to use a trimmer with the gas and you can also use that same method with using an electric trimmer as well. But a lot of people don't have those kind of trimmers so what some people do have is these and I'm going to show you how to trim with these. Now there are several different ways that you can be able to do it. Let me go ahead and start off by saying there is no right or wrong way. Just make sure that you're comfortable with doing it because you are going to be doing a lot of bending over. But I'm going to show you a couple of ways that you can be able to do it with using these. And we're going to go ahead and trim all of these bushes. It's a lot of bushes too. Let's jump into it. Since I can walk all the way around it, what I'll do is I'll get the bottom half first. I'll go all the way around the bottom get that first and then I'll start coming up and going all the way around so let me just show you we're gonna start with the bottom we're gonna just come up right there and we're gonna go all the way around it just get this side see all of this new growth we're gonna cut all of this off just doing the bottom just the bottom half making it even, just making it like a bowl. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start coming up the tree and then going all the way around. So we already got the bottom half, we're going to start coming up. And remember we're just laying it right on the bush. We're not digging all the way down in. So we just going to come up. Starting just midway, coming up. Going around, coming up. Then you step back and then you look at it. See if you need to go back over it. See if you see any loose ones. Remember, this is going to have the same method as if you're using the trimmer, whether it's electric or gas. Don't dig all the way in there. You just want to get just right on top. Just lay it on there and cut across. That's all you're doing. Just laying it on there. Don't dig in it. Just lay it on there. Now regardless if you're using the hand shears like I'm doing in this video or you're using some electric or gas shears like how I did in the other video, you always want to cut in a pattern. Make sure that you start at the bottom and then always work your way up. After you've cut all the new growth off, this is when you want to go over it several times to try to make it as smooth as possible. This is when you're going to define the bush. Now I know this seems like it's hard, but it's not. It's time consuming, but it's easier than it looks. Now the same method is going to apply even if you're cutting bushes into a square. Always start at the bottom and then work your way to the top. Now when I'm cutting the top, I'm treating it like I'm cutting in certain rows. So, for example, you see I start at one end of the bush and I cut all the way to the other end of the bush and then I move over and then start on the new growth that's next to the row that I just cut. Now, what you want to do when you cut everything straight across, this is when you're going to start to make that bush as even as possible. Now, some people do use strings, but you can also use your eyes by stepping back, looking at the bush and then judging it that way. But remember to lay it directly on the bush and don't dig in it. So that'll 
that wraps everything up folks what i did is i kept the same method i didn't use a tarp i cut all the shrubs all the clippings were down in here in the mulch i blew everything out and i'm going to clean everything up with a few mowing passings and to get rid of all of these clippings but this is pretty much what it looks like i just used the hand shears it's the only thing that i used it did take me a while doing it but just in case if you don't have any gas powered trimmers this is something that you can be able to do now just remember when you are trimming you want to just lay it on the shrub don't mash all the way down in it just lay it on the shrub and then just start taking it off i did the same method on all of the trees i started at the bottom went halfway up all the way around it since i can walk around the bush and then i started shaping up the top and then just trying to get everything as much in a circle as i could but this is pretty much what it looks like and i think we got a winner winner chicken dinner right here and once again i hope that you all enjoyed this video excuse the wind because the wind is kind of blowing but this is what it looks like once again if you don't have a gas powered or electric trimmer you can use the hand trimmers the hand shears and they will do the same job it's going to take a little bit longer but they'll get the job done i hope that y'all enjoyed this video y'all have a blessed one and i'll see y'all in the next one